A Lafayette technology company has developed a tactile tablet to assist the blind and visually impaired. As Star City's Asher Bookspan tells us, with this device, you don't need to be able to see to communicate. This device, Cadence, was created by Tactile Engineering with the goal of helping those who are blind or visually impaired interact better with technology. CEO of Tactile Engineering, David Schleppenbach, explained how the device works in a similar way to a phone or tablet. Instead of having pixels that you can see, it has pins that slide up and down that a blind user can feel with their hands. That allows them to read Braille, to communicate with tactile graphics, to interact with the web or other content. It also has features that other Braille tablets do not have. It's also capable of producing raised print, tactile graphics. We can actually magnify the Braille to help learners such as veterans or seniors who are newly experiencing sight loss. And we can even do interactive content such as a moving ball that helps people to track and interact with web content. According to Schleppenbach, 3% of people in the United States are severely visually impaired. Many visually impaired people struggle with employment, education, and engaging in society. Tactile engineering hopes to change that. The idea being that if we level the playing field with technology, we can see the underemployment situation among visually impaired flip to become an employment situation and productive tax-paying citizens. Another goal is to make Cadence as accessible as possible to those who need it. People spend thousands and thousands of dollars for a device that maybe only lasts for a few months or they never receive training for. We want to change that paradigm, make these as available and affordable as a phone or tablet would be to a sighted individual. And working with the state of Indiana, we hope to actually subsidize this for the visually impaired citizen so that they can receive this device at low or no cost. Tactile engineering has big goals, but is focused on helping Hoosiers first. Our commitment is to service blind citizens of Indiana first, before we work in other states and eventually the world. Asher Bookspan, Star City News, Lafayette.